Welcome back to another LEGO Dimension video. We are on to the third one, the third to final one. We're almost there, we're super close. This one, next one, and then the last level, which I still have not seen. I have not seen any of this. I've never played this. I've never played this far back on my original journey of this game, even though it's a good game. I won't even lie. So honestly, everything from now on is just kind of a new viewing. Which is kind of cool, you know? After playing all these Toy to Life games, it is kind of weird knowing that I physically have not fully played through this game. It's really weird, because again, I really did like this game. To be fair, everything did kind of explode, and I think maybe everything just kind of... Everything of mine probably died before I was able to fully get through it, which sucks. Which It really does. But today we've got E.T. and Bart, just because they're two characters I kind of wanted to look at. Especially E.T. E.T. is such a funny guy. He was the only uh, Wave 6 through 10 character I owned before I I put down the whole Lego Dimension game to rest. Uh, E.T. is such a funny character. I don't I don't know why I bought him. I, I, I don't know. I always have like this weird... I have this weird fascination with E.T as just a character in general i don't know why you i Ouch. fuck <laughs> i wouldn't be able to tell you uh i think i watched his movie maybe when i was like uh, man maybe six but the thing is with et uh i was six and it was in spanish so i truly don't know much i just know he wanted to go home that's it and then Another thing with E.T. was, I don't know if you guys remember this guy, his name is with the uh, Irate Gamer. He would, like, he would basically do the same thing that uh, the Angry Video Game Nerd would do, but he was my Angry Video Game Nerd. I never knew who the Angry Video Game Nerd was, so the only person I knew that would do, like, these, like, old game reviews and act all angry and stuff was him, and man, it was so much fun. Let me tell you, it was so fun. I, I, I loved that era now he's on doing some like spiritual journey shit at you but fuck i don't even know all right i don't know how you go that far onto his own thing but hey man whatever whatever makes him happy or whatever you can do whatever he wants if, if it's spiritual shit then uh, yeah you go for it i guess but oh that's annoying the only thing that's gonna be annoying about et is his fucking voice dude i didn't know he sounded like oh i actually have it oh I didn't know he sounded like this, but yeah, today, or at least the day I'm posting it, is July 4th, so, you know, happy America Day. It's kind of funny knowing that this holiday is just like, you know, universally is not celebrated because why would you? It's only for the Americas. And it's sometimes weird thinking that because when you play games, especially like online games, like Fortnite stuff, you're like, man, they don't have a lot of 4th of July stuff. I'm surprised they wouldn't do something for a holiday like this. And to be fair... The games that I, at least I do play are from the Americas, so you'd think they would at least put something in there, but it's, it's sometimes just universally just known as like, hey, you don't really need to do it. It's like, half your player base is not going to even know what the fuck this, you know, event is, but, you know, go, go one for the Americas. But, it should, it, th this should be out by then, or that day, I'll probably make sure of it. But yeah, if you do celebrate it, have yeah, fun, I guess. I don't really do much for the, for the good old day, but... You know, I know some people like to do stuff like that. Maybe see fireworks, something. Uh, I'm just not a person that really likes to do that type of stuff. I'd rather just do stuff like this, make videos. This is more fun to me. And I've actually been playing a game called Paint the Town Red, though, for a platinum video I want to make. And if you know uh, Paint the Town Red, it is a game where you're... Where, honestly, I thought all I was going to have to do was beat up people right like it was that was my original thing i bought it a long time ago maybe back in okay maybe not a long time ago but i bought it like two years ago from my last uh remembrance of it and with that there there's actually a story mode to it with like actual lore to it isn't that crazy uh Green, 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 red, green, 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 red, green, 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 red, green, green. Okay, I should just probably just wait because it seems like every single time you go side to side, it's just up. I'm sorry. 
Um, but there's actually like a full story to the damn thing that I've been like looking at, and it's actually it's actually like kind of cool. I'll probably talk about it when I actually do make the video on it, because I've actually been saving uh, saving my my, uh, my 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 reactions to things and stuff like that, which is something I don't do good enough at, you know. Because when it comes to like making a platinum video, you do want to at least have some some of your reactions to things and stuff like that but I, I'm just a person that doesn't record it for some reason I like to record the end of it like when I actually beat it and everything like that but when it comes to like just kind of like the journey with throughout I'm kind of bad at it that's actually kind of one of the reasons why I do actually want to start streaming some of those games but something I, I need before I can start doing that is I need to get a capture card so I can record it because you know surprisingly there isn't actually an option to kind of like display like achievements to pop up um, for some reason I find that kind of weird. Uh, simple, they don't allow you to actually to show the achievements pop up on your screen if you record, like how I'm recording right now. If you just record through PlayStation, you, you, there's physically not a way to do it, which I find kind of stupid because I feel like platinum videos are kind of like a big thing, aren't they? Like, they're maybe not like very mainstream, but like they're still kind of big, and I feel like there would be something to like just kind of allow allow for achievements to pop up. And uh, that whole thing that just showed me right now was supposed to help me in what I'm supposed to do, but I, I, I don't know. I'm hoping with these final levels that we're going through, uh, I can actually get the rest of the achievements that I need based off of it. Because all I need to do is finish up all those weird, uh, like these things, these like little tablet things. If I finish that, then all I have to do is go to like the the big hub areas, and I should be good. And again, I don't even know what that whole rocket thing was based off of, or what the hell that is. I've never dealt with a piece like that. But well, we'll see. We'll see if we finish it. I'll mention it. That's why. That's why if you sometimes hear me say that I found something or like I got an achievement, and you don't see it on screen. I physically can't show it, which is really annoying. And I feel like again, that is something you kind of need when you do a planet video. Is at least show that you at least did the damn achievement, but I'll I'll work on that later. Uh, this piece is stuck. What am I supposed to do about that? Like it just physically will not let me move it. Okay, there you go. It broke itself. Thank you. I'm glad Lego games have that feature, where just things just kind of automatically break if it doesn't move, because there's a there's a lot there's a lot of jank when it comes to games like these, honestly. And then. Let's see how else we got. Also, if you notice, my back card looks like a fucking scorpion. I actually upgraded this bad boy with all the money I've been getting from the levels that I've been playing. And uh, it's kind of nice, except for right now. Right now, it's a, it's like it's like a scorpion base. Thing. I don't know what it is. And I think... Oh, no. Our piece is fine. Our piece is good. But uh, Multiverses had their big patch thing. I actually got to play it recently kind of sucks that uh oh i forgot what this means okay um it kind of sucks that jason was taken out i think he should be back soon or either he is back now before i actually do it i don't know i played i played the day of and if you watch my um video on it i'll just have to make yellow i think or is that orange okay if you watch my um video on the patch it is actually pretty good. I fought a couple. Of, I fought against some Wonder Womans. I honestly felt like I was having an easier time with that comparatively to before. Um, Marvin still feels the same, dude. The input thing to take to get a, rid of that input buffer of 30 frames is so. Oh my god, godly nice. Like it is beautifully nice to be able to do that type of shit now, dude. It is. It was utterly annoying that you couldn't. Um, change it and now with me i do 15 i do 15 uh i do a 15 input buffer and it is utterly so nice uh like i actually feel like i feel a little bit more like how you used to play back in um the beta just a little bit just everything just feels a little bit more fluent i'm not fucking up every single move and i'm not utterly doing some of the dumbest stuff ever <laughs> like it's good it's so nice so i'm glad with that uh, getting rid of like the shitty colors that they used to have is pretty nice. They kind of, they kind of, they kind of fucked with us with what they called their like, their damage stuff, uh, and like seeing your stats now. They kind of fucked with us with that one, because everybody talked about them like, hey, we want this back. And they're like, yes, we'll put it back, 
But it's only the stuff when you go check a match after the match. Isn't that kind of stupid? You give us this update and you're like, hey, we're gonna put back. We're gonna put. What? I'm not even trying to go to the battle arena. What the fuck is it talking about that for? Like, you tell us that you're gonna put out this patch and you're gonna do all this. Okay, yellow, red, blue. That's good. Um, you're gonna put out this patch and you're gonna tell us you're gonna give us back our stuff. Yet, when you give it to us, it's not even the thing we're asking for. It's not even, like, you don't look at it after the match, which is really dumb. Like, I guess we got it in some fashion, but, yeah, uh, no. For me, personally, that's not what I'm looking for. Cool, I guess I can look after the match, but I don't want to. And, man, they really love using Marty McFly as these guest appearances to help us do stuff. Don't they? They really do. Oh, my God, he fucking died. He fucking died. Think that did it. Oh wait, no. He probably teleported. I, I, well, I'll say he teleported. I'll say he teleported. That's always the thing that's always shrugged with me. Is like, if you ever talk about Toy to Life, and you put like Amiibo on there, dude, Amiibo doesn't even count. It is so utterly stupid. They're cool. Like, for like a collections piece, they're nice, right? Like, I do, I do have a couple. But like, they don't do anything. And it's something I wish they kind of would have like, done with a little bit more. If they could have, like, messed around with, um... Okay, wait, how am I gonna do this? Oh, I need, uh... I need you. I'm gonna need you to switch this way, and then I need you to go this way. There we go. Um, if they could have messed around with, like, the whole idea of Amiibo, and maybe making a game with the Amiibos, or something like that, would have been so cool. It's been, it would have been, like, a Smash Bros. type of thing, but you could have used it in a different way. Smash Bros. is a fun game, with a lot of, like, cool characters coming through. I wish they would have made a game with the amiibos themselves that would act of, like just act of, like a character piece themselves. You know? They fiddle around with it with um, the Skylander one. Bowser and Donkey Kong, which, I, man, that blew my mind when I was younger. I would have never expect that. I wish they did a couple more. Sad that you can't use them in other services, but it would have been cool if they would have been. It would You know how cool it would have been if they could have got some like Sony or some Xbox things to do the same thing? What would you personally have? I don't even know what I would personally have. Like, what, 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 uh, oh, I, okay, I guess technically Crash. I, I don't think I should forget about Crash. I don't know if Crash is, like, is, is Crash Sony? I don't truly know. It was Sony's, like, thing for a while, but I don't know if they truly own it. I don't know what they would do, like, exclusive-wise, you know? I, I really don't know. There's his place. That's his little pent ground with everybody in there, which we have fought. Joker, the Riddler, Thief. Actually, Thief died. Yeah, I didn't get to show that part since I didn't really like that level in the general. Like, that was... Uh, okay, that was the worst level. But if you did get to see it, Thief got, like... He got obliterated. Like, he just died. But, to be fair, there's probably more Thieves. He's, like, a generic guy. Um... This one... I... Why would I... I'm gonna die, aren't I? <gasps> there's only one way to find out, I guess. Yep. <laughs> yep, I die. Maybe maybe I just have to do it before they flip, you know? So let's see. Yellow. Oh And it holds me now. So now all I have to do is wait until they go around. Fuck. I don't know how they're gonna squeeze in two more levels, honestly. Oh, please! Because the final level is obviously just going to be a boss battle, I feel like. It's just going to be like, oh, mega boss battle, right? But what can they possibly do to squeeze in, like, that middle half? Is it going to be, like, a two-parter boss battle? Out, what is that, a phoenix? A that is not a dragon. That is, like, a phoenix. And they didn't even do anything to us. It was so nice. Never mind, it burnt the floor. Actually, I just realized I have Bard out here, but I haven't done anything with him. Um... We have the thing. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. We gotta put out. We gotta put out the flames, and then we got our cool little timepiece right here. And luckily, Bart can do that. Bart, Bart wasn't Disney back then, was he? I don't think so. It's always something I keep asking myself because they had the Hellbot when it came to the portal level, but oh, okay. Wait, no. So now Bart's over there. Now we turn on this bad boy. Then we don't do that because it just I hate when you could do that because instead of it just teleporting to you the, the character like I like over there 
it, it teleports the character back to me. So I have to like, there we go. And now we found it. Wow. I hate that. Because it makes things like this where I had to kill poor E.T. To get over. And now we got a piece of the yellow brick road from the first level. Wow. Now I need this. Back here again. And we continue onward on the yellow brick road. Never mind. We got another one of these. To be fair, I do like these. They are, they are kind of fun. And I actually know how to properly use them now. Because usually I hold down the button and then I start clicking. But you're not supposed to do that. You gotta... You just gotta keep clicking. Oh, shit. Bart? Be good. Bart looks so weird in here. He has, like, the one character. Like, look at his face, man. Those eyes. Jesus. They're just... They're, like, literally bulging out of his skull. And here we go. Are we gonna get snapped up? Dude, this is like a Jaws moment right here. No, we're good. Never mind. Is it also Shark Week? I think it's also Shark Week. Thinking about it now. You got the thing for multiverses happening. Which again, cool. Uh, I, okay. I haven't, I worked a little bit on Agent Smith. And if you do watch multiverse stuff, I will be playing as him day one of the early access thing. I will make sure I get there. To be fair though, they still haven't fixed my glitch. So for some reason, back in the really beginning, when I was actually like playing a lot of the riffs and doing a lot of like one v ones and stuff like that, um, I did I did the Joker fight, and the something weird happened is like oh, is that with the Joker fight it didn't allow me to claim it as one, and they still haven't, they have still not let me like beat the Joker, fight, which is super stupid. So. I'm still one character behind. One character, or one thing behind, and it's super annoying. And I'm guessing this one more fight, and then we get to go save our friends, which we're missing Metalbeard, which again, I wish was a character. To be fair, they do have a bunch of reps already from the game. Um, uh, that one guy from Lord of the Rings, which I still don't know, because I still haven't watched it. And I don't know if I ever will. I heard the movies are kind of long. It's like 12 hours to watch all of them. And to be fair, I don't really have like a personal want to watch it. I like never have a personal want to watch anything that's mainstream for some reason. Except I do want to watch... I do want to watch... Um, the Boys. Really bad. But yeah, I get Prime, dude. It's so annoying with services like those. You gotta buy so many just to watch one thing. Just because they're all exclusive to one thing. I have The only thing I have is Max. Which, you know, to be fair, it's doing me well. You know, Adventure Time. You got Smiling Friends on there. You got basically anything Adult Swim. Like, that's awesome. I love that. I love watching anything Adult Swim. But, it's really annoying. You gotta get Prime. And I don't know how expensive it is. But, here we are. On to... I'm guessing the end. I'm guessing the end of this level. I'm guessing we're gonna save them or something. Or, never mind. We're, this is actually we're actually gonna do stuff here. Look, Beard? all our pieces are here. Your friends too, of course. And how the fuck does he? How do they have it? So are the minds of Moria when Wait, how does he? With the fellowship. Why does he have it? On your guard. I always am. <clears throat> he was against us, wasn't he? That little, that real, the little stupid robot. Uh, those are cool ass Lego pieces. Minions. Deal with these See, look, we're already like on the fight. I don't know how we're gonna base it up tomorrow. Uh, you know, for the most part, yes. Just because you've been kind of like going everywhere and doing weird stuff. And now you turn into dust. Um, what are you gonna do with that? I can't switch my character. Oh. He's just gonna smother me. Well, you shouldn't be so thankful, buddy. Look, he has all our pieces, doesn't he? Hmm. He has child be the elusive our thing. Bartman. Oh, I know. No. He, he got that shit from us. He has ours. He has the stuff that we weren't able to grab. It's been a while. It's always a problem with not playing these games, like in order or like you're just in one day. I I I can't remember from the past. He got the Homer Simpson thing. We he got the Kryptonite. We got the one thing. He doesn't have the cake, does he? No. Hey guys, so uh, this is gonna be kind of a pain, but the rift calculations mm. take longer than I thought. Use this. I'm glad you're. 
I'm glad you're just, I don't know how you're talking to us. I'm glad he can hear it all and everything like that. But, okay, so he's ice, so now we have to we have to torch him. Which, luckily, that's where Wild Style is. We're torch- Whoa! Never mind, we gotta wet him down. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta smother the flames. Which, I still don't know what we have to do. And I don't even know what E.T. does. E.C. must just do nothing. Here you go, buddy. I'm taking you down one flame at a time. Look at that, I moistened him up. He's good. And look, his dumbass is- Yeah. Get squirted on, buddy! Hapui! Hawk up with loogies and all that shit. Um. And here's the same fight again. I'll just do the same thing I did with, uh, <laughs> this Scooby Doo one. I'll be back when it, it's either done or something cool happens. There you go. Okay, so if it's the three time the charm rule, well, I just hit him for three times. So, let's see what happens now. That's cool, man. What is that? Did he just take us? Oh no, he just he's consuming everything, I guess. Uh huh. Use this. I've never seen that in my life, but I'm glad it's been seen. Which... Okay, we're acting like this is the end. Don't worry. Oh shit. Uh, goodbye. Uh, goodbye. Uh, <laughs> Oops. I. <laughs> I thought he was supposed to keep us from not going in there. That shit just took us. Where is it? Oh god. <laughs> I'm sorry. We, we got took and Bart, E.T. I'm so sorry. Alright, let's see. Who's gonna help us now? Who, who's gonna pop their little head out? Ah, uh, the Jordica? No. The, the, the Tekka? I forget what that thing's called. Bye bye, buddy. Never mind. You're good. Aww. Our poor little guy. The Riddler. Two Face. Oh, yeah, Robin! Frodo. That Robin reminds me of so much of the LEGO games. I miss playing those. I need to play the second one. That's the one I remember playing on my Wii. Uh, he took our shit. What did you do to Expo Joker? I put a smile on his face. He took all the stuff we had. We had that thingy, the thingamajig, the scarab. We had a coin. Oh, the Riddler coin. And he does have our cake. How? Uh oh. Well, now I see how we maybe can squeeze in another level before the final one. It's always cool like this, because like, realistically, a game like this is like a movie in itself. All this for a green square? True. The base plate. And why did he need a, the three people again? I forget why. <laughs> and he just took a chunk out of himself. Oh, did he combine everything? That's Metal Beard. The base of Metal Beard, the body of Robin, and whoa. Let's not find out the answer to that particular riddle, shall we? Come on! Yeah, dude. They're fucked. Metal Beard. The arm of Frodo, I'm guessing? Robin, oh! Only the A trifecta, huh? And... there we go. So, we have to beat up Tri. Where? I don't know. <laughs> you can't run forever. Every dimension is mine. And then we fight him. So we'll get our friends next time. I'm guessing. Like that's that's like all I'm. That's what I'm guessing is gonna happen. Destroy them, and then destroy their worlds. You know, it'd be cool if our if our actual like like our hub world actually gets kind of fucked around. But there you go, prime time. 
Not a bad level. Not a lot of happened in it. But I guess it was supposed to be like the setup of the whole world. And I wonder who we had to save there. I kind of like that with the saving thing. Why are we getting Jurassic World pieces here? That makes zero sense. Was it supposed to be a Jurassic World level and they just kind of got fucked around with? Oh, they fucked with what our bot man. I guess not everyone loves my carefree approach to protecting the universe. Sorry I couldn't save you. But I programmed the gateway. Are you gonna die? You must stop the tribe. I think this is the end for me, guys. <laughs> Try not to blame yourself. No! No, Expo. She's the one that gives me my packs for the week six. He tells me if I want to download stuff. Okay, there you go. Nor is he early. He arrives precisely when he means Content download required. Tax about Oh, it keeps telling me that because of Oh no! He's just dead on the ground. No. Poor little expo. But that's that's all for today, guys. Again, happy happy fourth of July. Thank you for watching all the way, if you did. Um two more levels. Next one we beat try, and then I'm guessing the final one we beat. Lord Vortex, or something happens in the next one where it's like a whole twist, and this guy comes back as a bad guy. I still don't fully trust him, but I don't know. We'll see. Well, I'll see you guys next time with another video. So, peace.